Hello guys, so for today we're doing something different. This is basically the same as my live unboxing, except I'm gonna record it, you know, just to see how it would perform or whether my long-winded comments can be <laughs> can be summarized. <laughs> so I have here a Hot Toys DX03 Michael Jackson from the look he has on the bad album or the bad song basically the bad video so the camera is an autofocus and can't help focusing on Michael Jackson's face <laughs> yeah so I really love this cover this is reminiscent of the of the record of the album cover man so I'm glad I'm glad Hot Toys got it and considering that this is DX03 this is like the very very young Hot Toys you know out for a great adventure and stuff just doing their you know what <laughs> just doing their thing I'm gonna take this out <laughs> there so very beautiful box very beautiful texture reminiscent of the old uh, DX of your so opening it how cool is that man this is like a, a vinyl record and it has some of his uh, a, a little bit of Michael Jackson's bio uh, yeah, I can zoom the camera inside without knocking things out. And this is the a vinyl record of, you know, a replica, I guess. I don't suppose this is a real record. <laughs> if it were, though, <laughs> that would have been very cool. So it's saying here that the awards that the album got, it was released in 1987, 1988. So it hit number one in the billboards in 1987. And then it managed to win awards. Uh, throughout the years so it's a very uh, Michael Jackson is very uh, an iconic pop culture you know uh, pop culture phenomena I guess so opening it we have him in the flesh man Michael Jackson our guy here in the in the flesh so this is so old-school DX which I love man I, I wish that they would do this I'm getting the Ahsoka Tano, the DX20, so I don't know, it's, it's a good time to get it so I can compare to my recent experience with this Michael Jackson figure. So I got this second hand, I got this off a really good price, uh, under $300, so that is basically the reason why I own it. So of course the, the paint is a bit outdated, but you know this is old school Michael Jackson man. This is what he looks like. Nothing is flaking nothing is falling apart so thank you to the seller Lance uh, he sold it to me he's a Michael Jackson collector and he even has the the, the bad hands man the Jamon hands <laughs> yeah so Michael Jackson the 80s he was like a superhero man that was the time when pop icons and music icons ruled the world and they were like superstars so that is the figure let's look at the dx series is more than the figure man it has to have the stuff the accessories so i i had also the the, the bruce lee dx01 the first dx ever and that came with a ton more stuff this one is a lot more light but this is this has an outfit option you can change it to this uh, dirty diana look so, but I, I'm not sure if I'm gonna mess with this, man. I, I really like the bad look. So it has an array of hands and the Michael Jackson stand and the instructions. So I, I don't know if it came with a backdrop. So I, it probably did, did not come with a backdrop or something. And this is uh, the glove or the sleeve. Yeah, this, I don't know, this looks weird, man. Yeah, I think this is a glove, a part of the glove. Uh, I don't know where it came off so I'll just put it near the pegs so it is a very very light figure considering it's a DX uh, the Miles Morales spider-man came with more stuff than this but I'm not really disappointed uh, if you're gonna ask me if this is like you know the DX of your or what I expected the DX to be uh, I have to say no, yeah, <laughs> because I was hoping, I mean, this figure has been out a very long time, but uh, uh, I mean, 
if this were like the first time I unboxed it, you know, I would have felt a bit bad that it didn't come with more as much stuff as the Bruce Lee because that Bruce Lee came with a lot of stuff. This one is basically similar to the later DXs that it's light. I mean the the Spider-Man Miles Morales uh, Spider-Verse came with less stuff than this and um, with more stuff than this and that figure wasn't even a DX. So there's that. So let's hook up this stand which is it is a battery operated stand but just like with stands like this I'm not gonna put in the triple A batteries there man it's just gonna leak in the future I'm just gonna forget about it in the future so uh, let's put in the stand so this figure I mean this is a grail okay it's one of the earlier DX's so it doesn't come cheap, but it's, it isn't as expensive as a lot of stuff. I've seen it in eBay and it runs around $400 and stuff. So if you were to ask me whether you're going to get this for $400, I'm going to have to say no to that. It's not worth $400, man. As you can see, the accessories, they're very light. It's basically just the stand, the extra outfit, and those hands. You know what? Let us might, might as well check the array of hands, but they are... Pretty, pretty typical array of dancing hands. I, I like the detail of the spike gloves though. You can spike yourself with that man. It's really sharp. This one, <laughs> so badass. You can spike yourself with that. So he really is like a superhero with this, in this kind of outfit. But that's everything that it comes up with. So they also have a non-spike gloved hand which we will take a closer look later. So the non-spike ones are for the Dirty Diana outfit. The spike ones are for the bad outfit. So let's look at it. Yeah, so these are the array of hands. So they're basically a bunch of dancing gestures. So it's, it's not so bad. I mean, it, it matches, it matches the the figure man okay let's do the let's do the crotch grab because <laughs> it's his signature move <laughs> yeah so it still looks really cool i mean that is michael jackson man that is like the if you look at it at a certain distance it's really like the figure came into life man the music video came into life is now on your shelf so that alone i mean if you grew up in the 80s if you grew up with michael jackson that is worth everything man so despite the, the light accessories it still managed to capture the outfit check it out the outfit and the the way the figure articulates and moves it's very very michael jackson i think this also has the purse movement system so let's move it move his eyes to the side a bit yeah see <laughs> pretty cool man so this this was the time when the purse was a DX option right now you know it's not necessarily a DX option but look how cool that is so I'm very thankful for for the seller who released this because you it is very hard to find so having said that thank you for hanging out with me thank you for checking out the review if you are a Michael Jackson or a music fan, I highly recommend this figure. You should get this man. So having said that, that is the end of this video, of this very light review. And have a nice day guys.